Hi, I'm Shelley from Best Buy's Plug-In Blog, and today we're testing out the HP Sprout. The HP Sprout is a touchscreen desktop and 3D scanner, so that means that you can use the mouse to manipulate it, or you can also use the touchpad. This is called the Sprout Workspace. If you want to scan something in 3D, capture a picture, or just play with the piano, you can do so right here on the touchpad. Let's just open the piano app. I'm not great at the piano, but I used to be able to play a really great silent night. Not so much anymore. But anyway, you get an idea of what the HP Sprout can do. Nah, I'm not very good. You can also play other songs. Maybe play along if you want to learn. As you can see at the top of the HP Sprout is the scanner and at the bottom is the touchpad. So they both work together to scan objects straight into your computer. So let's take Boba Fett here and see what he turns out like under the 3D snapshot. All you have to do is press 3D snapshot on the touchpad. Put good old Boba Fett right in the center. Click the camera icon. And just wait. It usually takes a few minutes. And there he is, right on the screen. Once you have him in the screen, you can manipulate him via the touchpad. First you have to hit accept. Actually. Then you change colors. I don't know if Boba Fett wants to be green. Let's try him in yellow. Maybe red. You can change the background. Oh. Now Boba Fett's stuck in red. You can make him 2D. And then you can just hit accept or cancel. And if you want to cancel, because we don't really like Boba Fett being red, we will just scan him again. We're going to try to 3D capture my son's Sum Sum. So you just hit 3D capture, and I've got him face up now, so that should capture the top instead of the sides. usually takes a few minutes to fully scan and there he is. So now once you've scanned him, because it usually does pick up other pieces of the mat, you can actually spin him around, zoom in, zoom out, or edit him, you change his color, you can make him 2D, I'm not sure. And then you can hit save. We'll try with the Millennium Falcon now. That's cool. And once you've captured the image, you can manipulate it, um, change the background, that kind of thing. Once you've captured your images, they're actually really easy to edit. All you have to do is touch the pad and hit create. And you can choose which image to move from your library to your mat. So you have to use your mouse. So we'll go over there and we'll pick Boba Fett. And we'll click move to mat. And there's Boba Fett and the Millennium Falcon. And you can add text, uh, change the background twist them around, make them bigger. My Boba Fett's really big. And shrink them down. So basically anything you want to do, change their color, 
create a file and and add text, you can make a poster, you can do anything in Create. Even when you're not capturing images or 3D snapshots, there's so much you can do on this computer. If you want to just play around with their sample projects, you just click Open in Workspace, and then you've got some paper dolls if you print them off, or you can just choose to play with them put on her ballerina costume, switch the bow in her hair, you can do almost anything. I hope you've enjoyed my little walkthrough of the HP Sprout as much as I've enjoyed using it. Keep an eye out for my full review coming soon to the plugin blog on bestbuy.ca.